It's Mark Wildman, who's also known as a mad scientist, but funny. You don't mind that title, though, do you, Mad love Scientist? It. Absolutely good. love Robert it. Robert Mark, good to see you. Right, first of all, you're going to make slime. You're going to make slime. We're all going to make slime, right, and we're right. going to be nice and speedy about it, because, yes, yeah, summer's here. Mm -hmm. And some is, uh, we don't want any, yeah, I, I hate the idea of a single child being born, so, uh, being bored. So let's, uh, let's make some science awesome as quick as possible. So first thing, some PVA glue. And one for you. Glue. Oh. Grab that. Glue like... Gonna start off with some glue. Okay. You're getting some slime as well. You've got a big decision to make in just a few seconds. Mm -hmm. You've got to decide if you're going for green, purple, or blue slime. Oh, I know already what I'm going like, for. Like, life-changing stuff. I was going <laughs> to choose purple. No, I was going to choose purple. Favourite colour, thank you, you know Green, that. I'll go green. Gone. I'll make one too so you don't feel silly. Right, I wouldn't green. want that. We wouldn't want that, would we? Uh, you said purple. I'm purple, please. Of course you are. So, uh, let's get some slime going. So we're going to need some... So you just use food colouring. Food colouring to make uh, slime uh, a nice colour. You can make white slime, but it's just a bit... A bit dull. You said green? Green, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, every good cartoon has green slime. Green slime's yeah. real slime. It's, yeah. the, it's the professional's yeah. choice. Uh, and the final one we've got... I'll, I'll go with blue, shall I? Yeah. And to turn out... So all we've got now is some coloured glue. If you grab a lollipop stick and okay. stir that... Thank you. Just stir. Mix it in. So that's just going to make coloured glue, though. And obviously coloured glue isn't slime. So to turn it into slime, we're going to do a really quick chemical reaction. Uh -huh. uh, this stuff is called borax or sodium tetraborate. Oh my oh, word! No. You want to be a bit of a fancy name? Is this now, legal? We're asking people to do this at home, Mark. We so. do need to make sure you wash your hands if you if you do this one. Where do you get that? From? Uh, you can get it from like pharmacies or chemists or online, depending okay. on what's easiest. But uh, and to make uh, to what's make it us normally slime, used for then? It's a really old detergent. Back in the day, it was oh. used instead of before washing up liquid. Uh, detergents got a bit fancy. Oh, okay. uh, but to make your slime, all you've got to do is start mixing. Mixing. You're gonna have to start yeah. mixing too. Mix that. Okay. Mix Ooh, your yeah. slime up and check it out. Quick. Keep an eye on it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, mix your slime together, and. Uh, so you've got to make sure you label this properly. You've got to label it up properly. You've got to make sure we don't want anyone drinking it. got to yeah. make sure we... When we do any science experiment, we always get all the children to wash their yes. hands afterwards, of course. Uh, but for quick speed, you can make yourself a beautiful, a magnificent batch Ooh, of slime. Oh, yes, yeah. yes. It's <laughs> yes. <laughs> In just a matter of seconds. Can I do that, put, touch uh, it with my fingers or not? Maybe not. We're, maybe not just now, because you look very, very beautifully well-dressed, both of you. <laughs> yeah. but, uh, Unlike yourself. If, we're, uh, <laughs> if you're dressed a bit more like me, or you've got your kind of messy play kind yeah. of clothes on, and it's so fine to dig in. And you've nothing to worry about here. This is not going to be toxic in any way, as long as you don't Ooh, look it. at yours. You're in short, <laughs> 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 okay. uh, That's going to be good. So, next up is a chicken in a cup. Oh. Just what you've always wanted, right? Oh, right. Of course it is. So, uh, all we need to make one of these, literally, you can make this at home really quickly. So, a lollipop stick or a pen, uh, tie some string around it, just a polystyrene cup, make a hole in the bottom, thread it through, kind of pull the string through, and you're going to end up with a uh, string through a yeah. cup. So, something you can make super quickly at home. To make it work, it's got to wet your hand a little bit, and hopefully. <laughs> 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 so if you want to grab, yeah, if you want to get involved, uh, obviously who doesn't want to play with a chicken in a cup, clearly? Oh. <laughs> the hands. There you go. Very good, very, very good. Right, Perfect. snow bubbles. Chickens in cups, what more? What more? I like snow bubbles. Uh, snow bubbles. So, uh, normal bubbles are obviously awesome. Uh, and the only thing that could be more awesome, I think, is snow bubbles. So, yes. bubble mixture, the best way to make bubble mixture is just to mix some washing up liquid yes. with some water, stir it all together. And obviously, kids love bubbles. Uh -huh. The summer, summer weather's bubble weather, I like to say. We're going to make a special bubble blower, though. And so, if you make a normal bubble blower, yeah. you can just chop the top off a plastic bottle like mm -hmm. that. To make a snow bubble blower, all we need is one of these kind of dishcloths, just a regular old dishcloth. Yeah. Uh, put it over the top, put an elastic band around there. Does it double, to, uh, double or just single? Whichever way. Uh, okay. That's going to make our Easy snow enough. bubble blower. Submerge it in your bubble mixture, which is just washing up liquid and water. Oh. And shall we... Uh, no, that's too small. That shall we mix some snow bubbles? Yeah, off you go, off you go. Let's see the result. Oh, very good. Oh, yeah, very, very good. good. Well, that's better than any bubble maker that I had ever bought. Yeah. Uh, when I was a kid. <laughs> it is. They're really so. weak solutions, mm -hmm. aren't they? That's the best really thing good. about a lot of science experiments, the best way to do them, you don't need to go out and buy anything. You can just use the great thing about these kind of experiments. Yeah. You can use stuff you've already got in your house. Yes. Can you do, do that one science. in about 30 seconds? And I'm not? sure your mother will be delighted. Your mother's going to be thrilled. She's going to love it. Let's try it. And if this goes wrong, I'll blame you guys. How okay. about that? Does yeah. that sound fair? So yeah. we need a cup. We're going to need a uh, toilet roll. Don't actually We're going to need an egg. Right. So it's an egg experiment, of course. <laughs> of course it is. And if this one goes wrong... What's the idea? What, all about inertia. So our egg's going to stay, objects at rest, remain yeah. at rest. The idea is we pull this out super quickly, the egg falls into the cup, okay. nothing goes wrong. Okay. There's no disasters. Go for it, then. Good. Ready? Ready. Steady. 
Ta -da. Oh, a little bit like that. There he is. <laughs> he is good. mad, but he is a genius. Mark, thank you very <laughs> thank much you, indeed. Mark. Thank you very much. Thank indeed. you very much. A few thank ideas you. there. Uh, feeling that, get outside. No! <gasps> it's amazing! <laughs> it's amazing!